Houses 1 to 6 at Rose Hill, Caulfield and Eagle Farm play the pick dog win bet with the tab app. And if your horse runs second or third, get a bonus bet back up to $50. It's bonus bet back on 18 races across three big tracks this Saturday. We're on. First online pick dogs win bet only. Keep your secret website. Imagine what you could be buying instead. For free and confidential support, visit gamblinghelponline.org. Here we go. 2024-2025. Don't get dizzy with me going backwards and forwards. Get used to it. Ready to make their mark on the track. To view the catalogue, photos, 
little dick. Oh, yeah, that's your head. Slam bar, master of surprise is the last one. They're sweeping down the side. 
past the 800 metres and high on sugar at a good tempo leads a slender margin on solar mist keeping it for company trying not to make it dizzy galbag was a forward who would already say that even sharper
Think of one nice and handy in second spot and top secret the rail third. Next on the outside, walk like a man within two and a half of the speed. Barricado Sun, Vieri in Brazil travels at the rear of the field. Inside the 600 metres, Kazovsky led. Think of one in second, walk like a man travels well in third. Top secret likewise derailed and Vieri getting to the outside. Barricado Sun and Brazil's on the inside at the rear. 400 metres left to go, Kazovsky in front from Think of one. Going back to the inside, top secret down the outside walk like a man and Maracaibo Sun threading the needle in the middle 250 left to go think of one a narrow leader Maracaibo Sun Brazil is charging home from the rear and also coming home hard is walk like a man for Brazil dash through grab the lead with 50 metres left to go where's Brazil, Vieri Brazil son of a bitch Wins from Maracaibo Sun Think of one, walk like a man. Vieri was next, didn't do much today. Then Not a lot. Up My the 10 space. bucks must have weighed it down. Secret. Three Brazil, written by Blake, speed page 770 and 190. He has a one Maracaibo, son 240 and the third six, think of one. God, the bears out at 250. The late scratching take note was number eight, Stan Geronimo. The late scratching, so he did have a food dividend there for think of one. It was $8.50 for the plate. Uh, Murray Bridge, uh, 639 and 8 for his French key fourth, but just away directly. And it's uh, and Rose still is starting to load, so let's get to Darren for race three. Merriman Bull has been really well back. Didn't do much last time out, but there's market to support there to suggest the mayor's going to improve here. So they're moving in well. Kill Rears moves in and Kabosh as well. So we're getting close to a start. Super strike. Might be the last there. Yep, the load is on. Stand by for action. They're on the loose, there's the favourite here at Rose Hill on this windy day. And they're racing and they're on the loose as one of the first in the stride from Faith Angel. Go the bear! That is a lot closer. Then Kibosh is rolling forward out wide on the outside of the Victorian chair. A gap into a true rear from the inside of Merriman Buller. And Super Strike is East being eased back to sit at the tail of the field. Baron the loose goes forward. That is Kibosh on the outside and the pair eyeballing each other at the 1600 metres. Shire drives through the middle of the pack to be promptly placed, sitting on the outside of Faze Angel. And this puts Madatsu back to fifth position. Two lengths clear from the cure rear there on the nose while on the inside of the well-supported man, Merritt Mount Buller. And two lengths away to Super Strike. So Bear on the loose in front, running down the back, a half in front to Kibosh, doing plenty of work in the first 600 metres of the race. Faze Angel's on the rails, further at the 1200. The Victorian well position sale went out one back, two lengths for the back from Madatsu. In the running line, just easing back a little bit on the outside of the cure rear. A length and a half to the mirror mount buller and two lengths to super strike. Inside the halfway mark now, and it's bear on the loose in front by a half length to Kabosh. Then Faze Angels travelling sweetly in third, a half the outside the shower. Two for the back to Madatsu on the running line on the outside of the cure rear. Two for the back mirror mount buller in the same margin back to super strike. We've got about 750 to go now, and it's Bear on the Loose in front. Shay takes off, so uh, Bayless has taken the attitude here. Fortune favours the brave, and he takes off from Shay to rattle the Bears' cage coming to the turn. Kabosh still there between them, and Madatsu cracks up now, peeling to the outside. Into the straight, Bear on the Loose just from Kabosh. Well, Shay's run a short lift, and Kabosh now throws it up to Bear on the Loose. He needs to fight. Coming home well now is Madatsu, and Mayor of Mount Buller on the outside as Madatsu moved up. The center. Madatsu put the head in front from Merritt Mount Buller, Bear on the Loose and Faze Angels. It's Madatsu grimly hanging to the lead. Faze Angels coming through late back. Madatsu! Madatsu's won it from Faze Angels and third of folks are there. Merritt Mount Buller on the outside of Bear on the Loose. So the Bear has given the Bookies a great present again. Further back to a cure rear, followed uh, by further back to a Shea from a short lived and Super Strike was last in. The nine with that to uh, Shelly Sicker to guard there for Kaynak, 4, 7 and 1, 60, 10 pays Angel, 2, 20 and third either, 8, Bear of Mount Buller, a dollar 60, or 6, Bear on the loose, a dollar 30. Dollar and 60 cents. Pays Angel's kept staying the trip out there with that very light weight with Matty Owen in the saddle, running a very cheeky race, and then the Mayor of Mount Buller on the outside looked a bit of a hope, but um, Faith Angels will run second and Merritt Mount Buller will grab third and Bear on the loose has done the punters again uh, here today. Beaten favourite of $2.40. So Madatsu first from Faith Angels, Merritt Mount Buller. Those numbers popping up on the board now. 
Nine, ten, eight, and six on the Barlow John Nicholson. Nine, ten, eight, and six. The time there is 2.03.56. 34, 35, the last 600 metres. Just the margins to follow. Just closer. Got back over the 53 and a half. This four-year-old got him by Stefano. So that Christine Ann today has been able to notch up his fourth career win and is two out of two here at Rose Hill. The nine of that two paid four ten and one sixty. Ten pays angle two twenty. Uh, eight mare about more one dollar sixty and six has run four pair bear on the loose. The exotic chase dividends shouldn't be too far away. Eagle Farm are up in three minutes, their third race, and then back to Albury for race number two, which is due in six. Uh, Rose Hill, Quinella, 1950, exact of 30.90, trifecta 97.40, first for 263.90, and the double 59.40. To run up a race seven, the result was Zion Spencer, 15.80 and 4.50, at the feet of 14, geriatrics 2.30, five Dusty Road, the third 8.20 and 16 ran fourth in electric time. Okay, let's pick up Bernie now on the Yard Eagle Farm. Favourite at two dollars twenty. So let's take a look at him from the Stewie Kendrick stable with Jimmy Almas. He looks well after his first up a run. He did it at both ends. He's a quick horse and he can run some time as well. The form's been Frank out of that. We've had Shamiro and I'm sort of Chris Mike's win at the Pollen Nova and of course Anderson the horse here and second one is next up. Number two is Hella Fast from the Kelly Sweeter stable. There is a move for him, five fifty into four eighty. Cody Collins, he creates some interest this horse. He's still got a bit of ground. the cricket again so it's a dummy ass on the races. Gets J Mac up and 1600 
Cricket outfits for the, for the coming season. What the discerning cricketer will be wearing. Uh, Aubrey, they're about to load up now for the running of oh. Here we go. Oh, and well, we missed a sneak.
A dollar fifty with that delay in the previous at Kim Lagrange almost probably run late to week two, but anyhow here is the upright with Sir Ben. Yeah, they're coming into the enclosure here for the second of the We'll see how we go, but uh, six minutes of betting time remain at least. Uh, Celtic 10, 420 to 3, favourite. Ordensia 6 to 5. Dame Commander 460 to 550. And then Yehi is $8 to 6. And that's about your race, according to the market at the moment here with pound.com. Celtic Sting is the favourite at 3. It's the best back. And they are coming into the enclosure now for the second. OK, it's so the Caulfield then now loading. City of Life's a $3.60 favourite. It's been a bit of support, Lady Jane. She's at 420. She's been 480 in before 20. And then see you in heaven. Uh, the Adelaide Bear, she's $5.50. And Brindley and Bell is $6. Uh, Vibrant Sun, 16 in today. It's a bit of a late rally. But for the... Uh, for the Cassidy, That'll so be four. For the Mayor, let's get to Madrill. The City of Life's favourite, 370 ahead of Lady Jane. Loud, that's not on the ground, is it? Matriarch Rose okay. going in. See you in heaven. Craig Williams with two on the board already. And Brinsing a bell. He's going to complete it. A beautiful sunshine here in Melbourne. See you in heaven. Take the middle alley. And Brinsing a bell is the final one. There's a bit of rocking and rolling going on there in the store. Better around the ground. It's America now who's quite agitated. Legacy at $6.50 and so it's a free 
see you in heaven. And Sue Ken, the way she wanted under Damien Lane. And Green Singer Bell, once she's free rolling in front, she can be hard to knock off. She basically had enough at the end of 1600. Private Legacy, a 33 to 1 shot, jumped out of the ground. Thrown by uh, Greg Hickman of Warwick Farm and ridden by uh, Ben Mallon, charging home. He's been beaten about a half neck, even a neck on the line. We'll see you in heaven. It's going to be one of those days on that planet. Third money. Shit, day. Three, ten, three it'll be after the fourth race on the program. Two, ten, and three. Green Singer Bell for Danny O'Brien. The mayor by Sham Express out of Ripsom Moor. Win four at start 14, but what a fantastic spring she's having so far. Then plus 136.98. It was a neck by a length and a half. Completed placing scorefield 2, 10, 3, and 8. City of Lights around the sun. The issue is unplaced to the late scratching of five Americana. Kevin Drummond is just running a length here. Uh, Richie Thunders of 2741. He likes to lighten the take a $12 check on top of Celtic Spoon. And uh, there's correct weight Aubrey on 5, 2, 3, 4. We do have correct weight there from Aubrey. And in a moment, uh, we'll uh, take you to Kimber. Down on the inside as they're on the first 200 metres. Then Cheval Bree. 
caught out a little bit deep in the early part of the event was the Seamus. Second last Scottish Pearl at Icon Dream is last week into the first bend. Uh, see they're walking here as they're under the first turn. Dane Commander and Celtic Finn, the joint leaders. Ordenzi is third and fourth the rail man, Yehi. A further two lengths away, Cheval Gris covering Blighty's Pope and Hazim out three wider. Cheval Gris in the centre and Scottish Pearl improving down on the rail. Two lengths away, Icon Dream with 7.50 left to go. The leader down the side, Dane Commander by a length, Celtic Finn second, down on the rail third in the box seat, Nan Yehi. Ordenzi is ready to stalk in fourth spot and ready to strike in that roller. Then came Dan, Blighty Tope, Hazim's out deep, Chevelle Grey, Scottish Pearl and Icon Dream with the lead out. 500 metres left to go, the leader at the turn, Dane Commander, led by a narrow margin, Celtic Finn, a challenger on the outside, then came Nan Yehi back to the rail. Ordenzi runs on out of the middle of the track with 350 left to go, Dane Commander had a good kick though, put three lengths on Celtic Sid or Danzia. Zan is absolutely storming home out in the middle of the track with 150 left to go. Dane Commander the leader. Zan on the outside finishing hard with Celtic Sid. The leader, Dane Commander. Dane Commander going great guns and Dane Commander. Dane Commander won by two. Zan, Celtic Sid or Danzia. Then Scottish Pearl, then Yehi, Icon Dream. Passed a few in the straight. Whitey Pope was next. Then Chevelle. Oh, we could spin. We could turn. That's all that plug on that video. Good wing, Dane Commander. Dane Commander Olivia Chambers paid six seventy one eighty eight Dan two sixty and seven Celtic Finn a dollar eighty four eight seven one gets four there at Kembla, which is ship uh, spinner. Let's see the Mitch Bannock down for race one at the Gold Coast on the All Weather. Mitch like six at the beachside babe at a five two and three. For the start, turn out the back, sunny days, clearly won the break. Straight to the front by Timmy. But which way the zoom goes sometimes. Like a tiger, Badge. Legend, proven correct into a yeah, prominent third. 
Next then running fourth is Mystery Deal, followed by Salangina Hassel Free. And Cypher's a little bit deep and easing back, and Angelica Peel is one of the last. Working through the bend at the 900 metres, and our selection is on the outside of Rising Legend, who doesn't want to give away the lead. Very deep at this stage is Mystery Deal, running third and fourth on the outside of Proven Correct, and then Salangina. Followed next by Hassel Free, and then Angelica Peel within Cypher back towards the tail together. Rising Legend, our selection, our selection and Rising Legend was proven correct, looking to edge off their heels as they approach the bend. Mystery Deal now feeling some pressure, Falangina, Hassel Free, then in Cyphering, and one of the last is Angelica Peel. They're in the straight and proven correct has now raised up to join our selection and Rising Legend, Falangina in hot pursuit, proven correct is a half on Falangina, Angelica Peel's winding up at the right time, proven correct, kept going for the moment, Falangina, and now Angelica Peel hitting top gear, Angelica Peel sweeping home to grab the lead and got the money. Angelica Peel from proven correct and Falangina third, in ciphering fourth in our selection. Really something going to happen here soon. Free rising legend and mystery deal. So two main scratchings in that race for nine, handsless and ten pretentious last. The winner, eight Angelica Peel for Tatum Moore. 3.20 and 1.40 over three proven correct, 1.90 and six Salangina, a dollar and 50 cents. The favourite ran fourth in Cypring, number two in, in Cypring ran the sum. Cornella was eight dollars, in fact a 19.40, price back to 57.40, two four hundred and forty dollars for double paid $12.40. Yes, super stuff in the outfield there, JJ. 5.13 was that result, so eight lay girls for 12.80 and five dollars. Over five can hear us. 2.40, no food for one ball para, and three ran fourth, which was sunny days. What they are doing is they're loading up at Tarapa for race eight. The safest race that precedes the group one, the Livermore Classic, is race nine on the, uh, the program. But uh, right now this is the eighth event. It's over 1,200 metres. And Candle is the favourite of $2.50. Yeah, looks as though they're going to do another lap, so we may have an issue with one of them drawn near the inside. There was a bit of movement in the stalls here. So they may be taking one out to... Okay, a bit of drama there at Tarapa. Let's hear from trainer Brad Wynn up there, uh, back, at, uh, back at Rose Hill. Ahead of race number four, we can grab, grab a quick word from Brad regarding 510 Rewell. It's coming up for a while. Here we have, we always target this race. Um, you go to Racing. Uh, probably not ideal, but look, he's a very tough horse. He, he's um, been racing three six years and look, I'd imagine he'd be up on a speed somewhere and uh, look, I couldn't be happy with him. 2,000 metres might hold him in good stead when it comes down to the nitty gritty. Hopefully, look, um, obviously the race is coming up. It, it's, um, yeah, look, he's in, in great order for today. Spinning because it looks like it's spinning about 10 foot to me. Okay, well, uh, we'll hear more from Sydney shortly, but right now, here's Josh with an update Eagle Farm. Okay, Simon, race number four, a strong benchmark 80, 10 minutes away from John Simon. That'll mark the Fab Favour Dressing, a bit late though, number five. 370 from 340, three hell of a party, 550 into 480, also 19 giggles at 550 into $4.80. 
Chapman Girl, 5.15 to 5, so there's uh, been money away from the favourite here. Acres away has been nibbled, 13 down to 10. Expresso is $10 down to 12. So Metal Art, his first go in Saturday grade, he's 1-4 from 4, resuming today. 370, hell of a party, give the old gender four dollars eighty, half and girl resuming at five dollars. Race four, nine minutes to watch. Love your racing? Want to take it to the next level? Join my runners and share in some of the most memorable race course ownership experiences with some of the best trainers in Australia. All for less than the cost of a beer a week. MIRunners.com. Life is just better with a race horse. Hot tab, where are some million dollar chase semi-finals? Nice catch, Badge. Season two badge. Forgot about that. About the first wicket, the first catch. First wide. Here on the horses, I day. Swift felt too late. Son of a bitch. Mate, uh, Bear on the loose didn't run a place. It knocked me out of about 15 multis. It cost me 100 bucks. Yeah, he's, he's having a spell for a couple of weeks. He's coming back for the Magic Millions and the Golden Slipper. Favourite for Golden Slipper now, 26 bucks. 
<laughs> I had 50 on it. Second place ahead of Tommy's girl side, Cash and Candle, and Mary Moore. 
And Broadway Field is last, so Mr. Gunnadu setting a solid pace in front, gets away in leg three and a half lengths with a bit over a thousand to go. Kingsway second, Tommy's Girl third. Then came Delonte about two lengths back to side cash. Mary Moore is getting up along the fence, and last of all was Broadway Spirit racing towards the turn over the back, and Mr. Gunnadu out by two and a half lengths. Kingsway gets a good run. Tommy's Girl the third play by Delonte, a break back to side cash. Over on the inside, Mary Moore and Broadway Spirit is last as they wheel down the side of Mr. Gunny Do. It comes down with about 650 to go. It's out. Only half a length now. Kingfrey went up. Tommy's girl is in a clear third play by Delonte. Side cash is one lost the rider here. Um, it might be the rider of Mary Moore might have come off. And last of all with Broadway Spirit. Kingfrey leads for home. Tommy's girl pulled out wide to make his run. Delonte is back boxing on. Tommy's girl is coming at King. Kingway, Kingway is uh, veering all over the place. Tommy's girl and Kingway. Tommy's girl, the outside. Kingway, the lot of us on the rails. Tommy's girl just fell it up. Kingway coming again, but Tommy's girl beat Kingway, the lot of third. Followed in by Broadway, third side cast. First and form, stand three, Tommy's girl, that's standing with three kings, two dollars, three kings, two sixty, no third to six, the long day. Getting closer to the third legal firm, Tiana Dickens, like nine, give Jiggle, over two, five, and six. Bernie Stick of the O, number five, Metal Up. Just about right, the light turned on. Race number four. Over the thousand here. Racing. Hell of a boat has come out second last. The planning conquest began well. Reigning King of Sandy. Going forward to Tim Boone, likewise for Skelly. Also, Kid Giggles going forward. And further back to Espresso, Metal Up. Wide round of Baker's the way. Hell of a body now third last and third the match to Mother's Crown Apple Girl was last of all. Flaming Conquest in front, second Kid Giggles and third the inside of Raining King. Wide out Michelle, followed there by Espresso. Thin Boo anchors away from the track and metal line back behind those and hell of a body staying towards the inside. In front Flaming Conquest out for 350. Raining King runs for second. Still there is Kid Giggles on the outside. Uh, wide out Espresso anchors away. Metal Favourite. 
Got to have the button in hand. Releases them now. They've broken a pretty good line up of 900. Hurry up, Angus. Southmore shows pace with Majestic Marama. The Deagle Warriors not far away. And so keep party on. And Sonic Cry's going up into that leading division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry. Sonic Cry is going to be leading the race. Sonic Cry going up into that leading division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to be leading the division. The Q Bee Sonic Cry is going to
race horses. 7, 16 and 13. 7, 16 and 13 to the running of the weekend hustler. Bah. The big display. Two wins this preparation have been outstanding here at Crawford. He really is an excitement machine. 7, 16, 13 and 14. Fifth number 6, Coast Watch. Six was number eight, not an option. They've clocked one twenty-two ninety-seven. The favourite has blazed away. The win race number five. So run, Harry, run number fourteen. This run fourth. Quinella is ten thirty, exact to fifteen fifty. Trifecta eighty two seventy. First four four hundred and thirty-nine dollars, and the double fourteen thirty. Next up, the Herbert Power Stakes, uh, the twenty four hundred metres. Uh, this is a more open affair. Six dollars the field at this point. The post completionist. <laughs> And yet up the equal. Should have worn a recliner. Tom Black Adam defeating Ken Majestic Morena. Nine dot third Mahi Mahi at four forty a place. And six and fourth Highland Bell. There's correct way to your phone on six ten two and three. Look at the start Tim Black. Big Thank you. 